what is up guys how's it going i'm here with mr mike and uh johnny back there say what's up johnny hi he's ready to go anyway we're gonna head down south again um conditions are really good low pressure wind coming from the southeast uh they got a lot of rain um on tuesday and mike's saying that they're supposed to get more rain here at 10 o'clock it's um uh, right now i believe it's 7 40 or 7 30 7 45 7 45 so we're gonna make it there it's probably gonna be dark while um when we make it there but uh yeah we should uh we should be able to see some snakes tonight so uh anyway we'll catch up with you guys later just started cruising uh, we had some issues with the fuel system with mr. Mike's car but we ended up figuring it out he just hooked up some a bunch of lights to his um, to his car so um, but anyway yeah we're in, we're in business we thought we we're gonna have to cut this trip short because his car wasn't taking gas but it ended up taking it so we're good anyway um, Let's see what we find. All right, guys, it's 10 o'clock. We haven't even seen a DOR. I mean, everything looks good. Temperature is 84 degrees. Pressure's good, wind's good. I don't know what's going on. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and try another road and see how it's over there. And uh, hope for the best. We'll catch up with you guys later. Guys, not even five minutes after I filmed that, Aatrox on the road. It's a small juvie. Glad we turned around. Yeah, it's a young juvie. it with the tongs I mean with those tweezers very nice anyway we'll take some pictures and uh, let it go see what else is moving maybe finally stuff is gonna start moving looks like a boy very nice Anyway, we'll take a picture and then let it go. All right, we're gonna go ahead and let it go where it was going. Ooh, didn't like that. No, you're going the wrong way, buddy. Yeah, you wanna, you won't let me grab it with the tweezers. Yeah, it was going the other way. Alright guys, got another Aatrox, hopefully it's not hit, it looks, oh it is hit, yeah, it's hit, darn it, alright, we'll get it off the road. Alright guys, just cruised up on this beautiful long nose, it was on the side of the road, really good spot by Mike, I was trying to fix my headlight I totally missed it but Mike was able to see it and uh, we pulled over and checked it out. And sure enough it was a snake it's uh, dark for uh, for down here in South Texas usually they're a lot more vibrant but uh, yeah this guy is a little bit on the darker side but uh, yeah, these guys are eating mostly lizards. They're lizard, lizard eaters, especially the uh, whiptail lizards. And uh, they call them long noses because you can see the, their, uh, the front of their, their head 
is pointed and it's elongated a little bit. Hold on, little guy. You're fine. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and take some nice pictures of it and uh, let it go. was headed awesome Good deal. let's keep her all right guys we got another atrox starting across the road Another little juvie. Very cool. Looks like a boy. All right, we'll take some pictures and get it off the road. All right, got a Natrox. Look at a thorn I saw. A DOR, but then we saw this. So it's still a juvie, but uh, better sized for sure. Very nice. Just looks like a female to me. Anyway, we'll let her get off the road and keep harping. All right, we got a, another eight trucks. Just got off the road. Looks like a little bit like the same one we just saw, but skinnier, right? Anyway, we'll just let this guy get off the road, take a voucher shot. All right, guys, it's 12:14, and uh, we've seen five snakes on the road, four eight trucks, one long nose. That's pretty much it. Um, we're gonna cruise here a little bit more, and then we're gonna start heading home. But uh, we'll keep you guys posted. Got another eight trucks. Eight trucks number five. It's a nice light one. Is it crossing the other way? Yeah. Ooh, he's fast. He's nice and warm. Yeah, not as yellow as the one we saw uh, two weeks ago. Anyway, we'll let it get off the road and... Uh, Take some voucher shots. Oh, look, there's a rabbit right there. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, get off the road, buddy. Cool, keep harping. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for tonight. Uh, saw five, six snakes total, five eight trucks, one long nose, so not bad at all. But uh, anyway, I might go out tomorrow night, so I'll combine that this video with tomorrow's outing. Um, I don't know still. Uh, maybe if not tomorrow night, maybe next weekend. So we'll see. But anyway, we'll see you guys in the next part of the video. Bye. What is up, guys? How's it going? Coming at you from San Antonio. I'm with Mr. Mike and Johnny Boy. Say what's up. Anyway, uh, yeah, we're heading east, northeast of San Antonio today. Um, there's going to be uh, a whole nother uh, plethora of, of uh, reptiles, not really the South Texas kind. Um, there's going to be cottonmouths, um, broad-banded copperheads, lots of them. And, fireflies. Oh, yeah, there's fireflies there. Yeah, like Johnny was saying. It's so cool there. Yeah, he really likes the the uh, the scenery over there. It's beautiful. 
but anyways yeah there's there's lots of uh, other kinds of, of reptiles to kind of switch it up from the south texas that you guys have gotten all year this year so um yeah i'm excited we're uh we're pumped so uh yeah let's get going and uh we'll catch up with you guys when we get there guys we're cruising hopefully um, we start seeing snakes here soon it's uh, what time is it right now Mike uh, it's 7:40. 740 so the Sun's gonna go down at 820 so we got a little bit less than an hour to cruise up uh, eastern hog cottonmouth or some diurnal species so let's keep our fingers crossed guys check it out we're just cruising this road and there's this armadillo just digging looking for grubs look at him just digging that's a big one I want to hold it stinky anyway we'll leave it alone I think he saw us yeah he saw us Anyway, let's keep herping. All right, guys. The sun is setting. I think we got about five minutes, six minutes of sunlight, and then it's going to be dark. And hopefully the snakes are going to be coming out. And fireflies. And Johnny's wanting to see fireflies, so let's see if we can make that happen. But uh, anyway, look how beautiful it is out here, guys. Just gorgeous. All right, guys, just cruised up a coral snake. I was trying to FaceTime my my daughters, and uh, Mike goes, snake, snake, snake. And then he goes, it's a coral. Dude, I've never seen a coral snake on this road. It's really cool. Let's see if it'll, it'll just chill. Here, Mike, can you, can you record me? Beautiful coral. It's really dark and it's a good sized animal. It's a boy. Very nice. So cool. Gotta be real careful. Not let it get too close. But look what a beautiful animal. What a beautiful snake. We're gonna take some pictures of this beauty and then release them. But, uh, wow, our night's made with this <laughs> coral. Such a cool animal. Wow. Check it out. Anyway, uh, let's take some pictures. All right, guys. This thing is posing super nice for us. It really, uh, it really is making the whole trip. Check it out. Just a beautiful animal. Anyway, we're gonna release this beauty and keep herping. All right, guys, we went ahead and tubed it. We had a perfect tube size for it. So Mike here is checking it out. Just look at this animal. It's, you can get a real close up on the, on the head here. Oh, no, the light, it's not really wanting to cooperate, but it's a beautiful animal. Of course, these are snake eaters. They eat mostly snakes, skinks, lizards, and their venom is a neurotoxic venom, just like the cobras, same family, they're an elapid. So they uh, 
when they bite they prey it affects their nervous system but uh anyway mike you want to go ahead and do the honors and let it go oh, yeah. just be real careful he's going this way there he goes perfect what do you think bro excellent man that was a lot of fun i'm glad i awesome. saw that heck yeah johnny what'd you think he, you were keeping your distance though, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's keep herping. All right, guys, it's 10.15. We've only seen that coral snake. We actually saw another snake, uh, but it got off the road um, before we could get to it. We don't know what it was. We think it was a cottonmouth, but we will never know. Uh, but anyway, uh, yeah, 10.15, 82 degrees. And um, bugs everywhere, man. I don't know if you guys can tell, but there's bugs everywhere. So hopefully we uh, start seeing snakes here soon. But I'll keep you guys posted. All right, Johnny's got a toad who's crop, uh, crossing the road. What do you think, Johnny? Cool. What do you like about it? It, it, it has... Bumps? Yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll let it go. Is there, is there a water area? No, they, they don't need water. Just put it on the on the grass. All right, let's keep herping. All right, guys, since it's slow, we stop for this huge stick bug. Look at the size of that thing. Huge. Look at that. There it goes. Anyway, let's keep herping. Guys, just cruised up a copperhead. Check it out. We straddled it, and then we I saw it last minute. Mike totally missed it. But uh, sure enough, little juvie, broad-banded copperhead. Really pretty. We got that green tail. Very cool. Anyway, we're gonna take some pictures and uh, let it get off the road. All right, got some good shots. Now we're gonna escort them off the road. See if you'll cooperate. A lot of times they can be real spastic. Yeah, you just let them. There he goes. Awesome. All right. <laughs> Keep herping. Look what Mike uh, just snagged. We thought it was a snake or we we didn't know what it was, but huge female walking stick. Dang, Mike. <laughs> Let's let it go. Let's keep open. All right, guys, that is all she wrote. It is, uh, what time is it? 12? 12? 12.20. 12.20. Uh, it's been more than an hour since we've seen any snakes, so we decided to call it a night. Uh, still a really good night. We lost that one snake on the road. We don't know what it was. Uh, Mike had a, a brief look at it, but he couldn't identify it, and it went in the grass, and then we couldn't find it. But anyway, we saw the nice coral snake. That was a good-sized male. And then we saw that juvie copperhead, uh, which was really nice. Uh, so yeah, um, this is going to conclude the video. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, uh, hit the like button and comment. We'll see you guys in the next episode. Later.